What's going on, guys? Um, today, free agency happened. Um, a lot of big moves. None particularly for the Penguins, but we'll still go over the Penguins once. So, first of all, we re-signed Evan Rodriguez. I think it was one million for two years. Depth signing. Not angry about that. Um, he was all right. He's gonna be in the fourth line or a scratch, so it doesn't really matter to me. Um, then we got we signed Dominic Simone, who I am just so tired of. You know, we finally got rid of him, and then we decided to sign him again. I wouldn't be mad because it's 750k a year and only for one year. I would be fine with that if he was on the fourth one. But you know Mike Sullivan is just gonna straight put him on Sid's line on the first line with Gensel or Russ, probably Gensel. And he's just not gonna produce at a first line rate. It's so frustrating with him because he's just he's like a worse Connor Sheary. Ah, he just he's too not small. He just can't shoot the puck. Um, but and when you you play with Crosby, you need to know how to finish. You need to shoot the puck. You need to know how to score, and he just doesn't. That's why Gensel gets so along with him so well. And Russ, they both know how to score. And then the big one, big sign in the day is Brock McGinn. Pretty much a replacement for Brandon, Brandon Tanev. I'm not upset. I actually really like the deal. Um, four years for $2.75 million each year. Um, some people were saying too long, but it doesn't matter to me because like in four years we're not even going to be competing at all, I doubt. Um, we might not even make the playoffs this year with the division we're in. But like, I it's an alright price, he's going to go in there, he's going to be physical, he's going to hopefully score, hopefully he's on the third line with Carter or someone else, Bluger because Gino's injured for the first few months. Um, yeah, I, I, I do like that move, but I'm pretty disappointed with Ron Hexel. I mean, first of all, Dominic Simone. That's just, that's, that's all right. I don't, it doesn't matter to me, but like it does because he's going to put on on the first line, but that's not Hextall's fault. It'd be a good signing if he was on the fourth line. That's what I'll say. But I'm just wondering a minute. He didn't fix the goaltending, which possibly could come in a trade. I know he was saying it's probably going to come in a trade. Hopefully it does. Um, we didn't get anyone to fill McCann's spot. That's still open. Uh, yeah. It was just disappointing all around. We didn't play, get anyone to replace CC. I mean, good thing you didn't sign him for that much. That Edmonton did, but we didn't get anyone to fill in for him. Maybe P.O. Joseph comes up and plays, replaces him. Yeah, it's just disappointing all around, but I do like the McGinn signing. Tell me what you guys think in the comments of any of the deals, any of the non-deals, and like and subscribe. Peace.